Electricity Learning about electricity and its importance Dear students, can you imagine what would happen to our lives without electricity? Well, it would be very hard to imagine life without electricity. Electricity occupies a very important role in our modern day lives. Electricity is a convenient and controllable form of energy for a variety of uses in homes, hospitals, schools, industries, etc. It is the backbone of a modern day life. Have you ever wondered what constitutes electricity? How does it flow in an electric circuit? What are the factors that control or regulate the current through the electric circuit? In this chapter, let us understand and learn more about electricity. We are aware that the flowing water constitutes water current in rivers. Similarly, when electric charge flows through a conductor, for example, through a metallic wire, we say there is an electric current in the conductor, in this case, the metallic wire. Electric circuit A continuous and closed path of an electric current is called an electric circuit. Now, what happens if the circuit is broken? The current stops flowing and the bulb does not glow. Scientific definition of an electric current Electric current is expressed by the amount of charge flowing through a particular area in unit time. In other words, it is the rate of flow of electric charges. If a net charge Q flows across any cross section of a conductor in time T, then the current I through the cross section is I is equal to Q upon T. The electric current is expressed by a unit called ampere and an instrument which measures electric current in a circuit is known as ammeter. It is always connected in series in a circuit through which the current is to be measured. Conventionally, it is considered that the current flows from positive to negative in an electric circuit. But the actual fact is, current is a flow of electrons and its direction is from negative to positive. Therefore, the direction of electric current is taken as opposite to the direction of flow of electrons, which are negative charges. Potential difference When a cell is connected to a conducting circuit element, the potential difference sets the charges in motion in the conductor and produces an electric current. We define the electric potential difference between two points in an electric circuit carrying some current as the work done to move a unit charge from one point to the other. Potential difference V between two points is equal to work done W upon charge Q. The SI unit of electric potential difference is volt V. The potential difference is measured by voltmeter. The voltmeter is always connected in parallel across the points between which the potential difference is to be measured. That is all in this topic. Enjoy learning!